Hi, dear friends. I'm speaking to you as uh, the chair of the Ministry and Personnel Committee. And for those of you who aren't familiar with uh, what the Ministry and Personnel Committee is, uh, we're kind of like the HR department. Um, so I've got some news for you um, as a member of the board and uh, in my role with, uh, with Ministry and Personnel. Reverend Lee Sinclair's request um, was officially received by the board on June 30th for a change in pastoral relationship. And this request was received by the Pastoral Relations Commission of Northern Spirit Regional Council at their meeting on July 2nd. This means that she will no longer be uh, Minister Robertson Wesley and she will be taking a new role in the United Church. Reverend Lee will not be working at our church during this time of transition and she won't be in contact with participants or with staff uh, as of the date that she submitted her request. The Ministry and, and, board, ministry and Personnel and Board are committed to, um, to working together uh, during this time of transition and to supporting staff and the congregation uh, with changes to programming and worship services and also communicating regularly with you. Um, we're also going to have some help from the broader church. Um, the, uh, the Pastoral Relations Commission has arranged for a retired minister, Reverend Dale Irving, uh, to help us with conversations um, like around Lee's departure. Please let Reverend Karen Bridges know if you would like to speak with Reverend Irving. So today we're going to say farewell and wish Lee all the best success in her new pastoral role. We are going to arrange to collect messages in a group e-card and we'll give you more information on that as soon as we have it uh, pulled together. So I'm going to give the last word to Lee. I'm going to read from a letter that she submitted to the board. I've been blessed by the strength of Robertson Wesley's commitment to its statement of welcome and inclusion, the congregation's efforts towards outreach, as well as its commitment to spiritual formation for all ages. I am grateful for the support the staff receive in this congregation through its committees as well as its many participants. I will miss experiencing worship, pastoral care, and learning alongside you. I am amazed and I will always feel grateful for how you strongly continued being the church in the midst of the new setting brought on by COVID-19. I regret that I am not able to hug each of you goodbye as our covenantal relationship comes to an end. So, dear God, we pray for grace and support during for us all during this period of transition. Amen.